is Marlene from Art by Marlene and I just thought I would show you a bit of my desk where I am working every single day and from left to right here you can see where I put my stamps that I'm busy working on at the moment and so my last ranges are always in this little desk unit here. Here I've got all my pencils and new products and there everything that is extra that I don't use very often. My go-to products are actually on my desk of course all of my acrylic paints and my special effect paints and my sticky glue, my water, all the base papers and everything. You can see my acrylic blocks up there and everything extra. This is all my different inks that I use different mediums that I use and of course up there you can see my acrylic or my alcohol markers my die cutting machines embossing powders oops don't want to show you that yet so need to quickly move away from that uh, some journals and the higher up I go the less I use the products every single day so I'm going to take you here and I've got my journal in front of me at the moment and I'm just going to show you a bit of a flip through because I think you can better uh, see the effects of everything when I take you through. You can see that I've used some um, stencils in the background, some collage papers. This is all created with my die cuts from the Out of This World collection. Don't look at my messy hands, it's just all ink, it's not dirty. <laughs> There's one of those lovely uh, angels and I decided to put her in my journal and you can see I've cut up one of my scrap papers and I've used all of the extra scrap papers to just tie it all together. This is the slimline cards that I've actually just opened so I can put them in here. Here I've put a little pocket and a little card in there. You can see it. see the beauty around you with the stamps the new stamps in there I haven't decorated the backs of these yet it's a, always a journal is a something that's a process this is a journal page also with a slimline card on there that I've created here's one of those little tags and those are from my bunting set die cut from there these are also the tags this side has to be decorated still and these are from the out of this wall die cuts so and this is from the stencils at the moment that I have the quotes this is scrap paper that I decorated and painted and worked on this is something that I created quite a while ago already. I stuck that into my journal. My life, my choices, I will live my life to the fullest, never letting fear lead me now or ever, taking control of my own destiny now, living, loving, trusting, believing that one day I will succeed. Just dream. That's something that I always think is very important. This is on black paper, on the black paper refills with a quote and some scrap paper and some acrylic paints. This is with the new gold stamps, some acrylic paint once again on the backgrounds. All the acrylic paints and everything used is of course from the Art by Marlene collection because I've got those gorgeous neons you can see there. This is also scrap paper and loads of acrylic paints and pastels and whatever layered stencils and stamps and acrylic paints, colouring pencils, I love using pencils, you know that. You can see one of those new die cut tags, stencils used on the, this is actually created on the perfect size journal and I've actually stuck the perfect size journal in here and where the holes was I just took a little ribbon through there. But I kind of like the way that it frames the page. Next week has been exhausting. Happy days. And a journal page. And you can see the glamour glitter 
on the that I've used and the diamond glitter I've used on there and acrylic paints so that is a bit of fun so that's about what is in this journal at the moment and this is of course what we call the artist size journal it's got the elastic that you tie around and that's it well thank you for joining me bye bye